Kanis Fatima, good girl. Kanis Fatima, everyone loves her. Mm. She is truthful. She strives the wrong and enjoys the right. <laughs> everyone loves her. Mm. She is truthful. Mm. She strives the wrong and enjoys the right. <laughs> Yay! Yahoo! It's been quite some time. We haven't seen Sister Armin. Hmm. Shall we go to meet her tomorrow? Yes. Let's make a plan. Uh. Uh. Oh! Uh, oh! Watch out! Right ah! there, be careful! Ouch. Ouch! What is your problem? What's wrong with you? Why are you after me all the time? You should have been careful yourself. Say sorry to me. You want me to apologize? You must be joking. All right then. Let me tell sis all about this. <gasps> all right then. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. Please, please, please don't tell sis. Please move out of my way. I will definitely tell sis now. Ariba, aren't you my best friend? Let's forget about it. Come, let me tell you something. Okay then. Tell me. I use a mobile phone. Who's mobile? My dad's. Your dad's? But Rika, we should make sure that we don't use someone else's stuff like this. My dad doesn't let me use it at all. What can I tell you about it? It is so much fun. Hmm, is it? If you let me use it as well, then I won't tell sis anything. But this is blackmailing. All right then. Let me just tell sis then. Okay. All right then. Come on, follow me. Hmm. Allah Where are you guys going? <gasps> Should I tell her? Uh, uh, um, sis, no, I'm just taking her to my room. All right then. Good girl. Whose room is this? My dad's. This is where he keeps his mobile phone. Okay. You stay here. I'll go inside and use his mobile phone. I will use it for five minutes, and then it is your turn. But Ariba, as soon as you see someone coming, give me a shout. All right then, but make sure you come back quick. Okay. Hmm? Hmm? Why isn't she coming out? She's taking way too long. Right, guys, it's been over five minutes now. It's my turn now. Otherwise, I will go and tell sis everything. You're my best friend. Please. One more minute. It should not be more than one minute then. Otherwise, I'll come and take it myself. Hmm. <gasps> Ariba, what are you doing outside Dad's room? <coughs> Why aren't you saying anything? Why are you mumbling? Sis, you? And by the way, where is Rika? Um, sis? Ariba, tell me the truth. Where is Rika? <gasps> sis! Rika, first of all, come out of the wardrobe. Kitchen, make sure that they don't lock up themselves at any such place where they can have breathing problems. I explained to you before as well that we should not use anyone's belongings without their permission. And we should not go in dad's room without his permission either. And we should not be using mobile phone all the time. And we should make sure that we don't engage ourselves fully into these gadgets. And we should not watch any such cartoons on the phone that make our beliefs corrupt and are not beneficial either. What else should kids do then? Neither can they play a game, nor can they watch TV, and they can't play outside either. <laughs> Rika, whenever you are talking to someone, you should not leave it midway through due to getting angry and upset. This is against the manners. And then you came in dad's room without taking his permission. This is also against the manners. And then you used his mobile phone, which is also against the manners. Now listen to me. Right here, we can read a book, help out mum in household activities, engage ourselves in art and craft, and so many other things. My friend's parents give her a mobile phone themselves. Yeah, I know, they're wrong in doing so. The parents should make sure that they keep mobile phones away from children. And if you do want to watch something on the mobile phone, then first take your dad's permission to watch cartoons uploaded there. Gulam Rasul, Kaniz Fatima, you will definitely get entertained through these cartoons. And in addition to this, learn various new things. Jazakallah, sis. You taught us such beautiful things. Kaniz Fatima, good girl. Kaniz, good girl.